My name is Madonna Thunderhawk. I uh, am a member of the Ouhenupa uh, Band of the Lakota. Uh, enrolled member of the Cheyenne River Sioux Tribe. I've been a community organizer and uh, Indian American Indian activist my entire adult life. Okay, LP, LP came along. What it what happened because they're not affiliated with any tribe or any federal agency or nothing. Independent, okay? And um, what it did was it validated, especially those women who for years on Pine Ridge had been, you know, really working and, and dealing with the local politics and, you know, lack of funding, what have you, to pull Lobo together. or at least make, make it an issue. And this has never happened in this realm that I know of in the state, where anybody's ever done this kind of work. Yeah, 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 if we were, you know, if we were doing it for ourselves, we'd still be plowing ahead with the lawsuit. But no, you listen to the people, listen to the, you know, the families, what's important for them. They need technical assistance. That's what the equity directors are saying, and the families are saying, we need help. With today, on the ground, for them, what's happened to them on a daily basis, that's the value of what LPLP has done. And I'm talking from grassroots, on the road person. I'm not a <laughs> bureaucrat, I'm not an office person, you know. Uh, so I can see, I can see what's going on out there. And, uh, and I'm still here, because I don't, you know, I don't, if people don't walk their talk, then I'm out of there, you know? So that's the value I see. And it's helping our people on the most basic, you know, of, of first of all, saving our children and then support for the extended family, because that's the Lakota way.